What is going on, mortals? Mortal T here! And today, we're back on some more Ark Survival Evolved. Because I'm going to be showing you how you can spawn in the bosses for the Valguero map. Yes, that is right. We are on the Valguero map currently. And on the Valguero map, there are three bosses. There is the Megapithecus, the Dragon, and the Manticore, and they all have their own special boss arena. So they all spawn in at once, and you have to kill them all in the same arena at the same time. But today, I'm going to be showing you how you can spawn them in on the map, this map that I'm currently standing on, without having to go to an obelisk, and gathering all the tributes and artifacts and stuff just to be teleported to the boss arena. We're going to spawn them in right here, right now. And in order to do this, you're going to have... You're going to... You have to have access to the console commands. Now, if you're on any type of server at all... You will need permission from the server host to get access to these console commands or admin commands. Once you have av <coughs> once you have got access to these, if you're on console, press the pause button. If you're on the Xbox, you are now going to press L1. LB, RB, X, and Y, all at the same time. And these boxes up here should pop up. If you're on the PlayStation, I believe it's L1, R1, Square, and Triangle, all at the same time, and this should pop up as well. If you're on PC, there is no need to go on to the pause menu. All you have to do is press the tab key, and a little black box should appear on the bottom of your screen where you can put the codes in. But I'm currently on Xbox. So I need to do the pause menu. So without further ado, let's get on to all the codes that you will need to spawn in all the bosses. So there are three bosses and each boss has different levels. So you got your gamma, beta and alpha versions. I'm going to go through all those codes and spawn them in on the map in front of you. So, here is your first code models. It is admin cheat, leave a space, summon, leave a space, gorilla, underscore character, underscore BP, underscore easy, underscore C. So, as you can tell by the code itself, this is for the Megapithecus. Now, this code is unique for Valguero. This code should not work on any other map that has the Megapithecus in. This is the Gamma version. As you can tell by the health bar, it is green. Now, to get the Beta and Alpha versions, it's actually really, really easy. You don't have to put in the whole code again. All you're going to do is go back into the code. Don't delete it. We just want to get rid of one word, and that's the word easy. And we're going to replace it with the word medium so your code should read admin cheat leave space summon leave space gorilla underscore character underscore bp underscore medium underscore c and there you have it that is the beta version as you can tell by the blue health bar they're all having a battle with trikes and stuff really cool but for the alpha version, yet again, it's actually very, very easy. We're going to go back into the code, change the word medium to hard. So it should read admin cheat, leave a space summon, leave a space gorilla, underscore character, underscore BP, underscore hard, underscore C. And boom, we spawn in the alpha version 
by the red health bar. So there you have it. That's all three versions of the Megapithecus on the, the Valguero map. This is one of the bosses. Like I said, there are three bosses, and we're going to spawn them in all at the same time. The good thing about the Megapithecus is when you do spawn them in, that they, they will run around, as you can see. And this can be useful if you want this to be like some kind of world event, maybe, in your server. Or you just want a bunch of these guys wandering around in the wild that survivors can come across and um, kill and get some really cool rewards from. Um, yeah, so these are good because they wander around a lot. The next two I'm about to show you do not wander around uh, a fat lot at all. Um, but they're still part of the Roguero boss chain. So let's keep moving on. Here is your next code. It is admin cheat, leave a space summon, leave a space dragon underscore character underscore BP underscore boss underscore easy underscore C. So it is slightly different from the Megapithecus. But we can spawn in. Boom, there you go. That is the first Gamma Dragon. Unfortunately, with these dragons, they don't tend to wander around at all. They tend to stay in one spot and they don't really uh, attack or do anything. As you can see, we're right underneath it. It's not attacking me, it's not nothing. It's kind of doo doo and they just stay in one place. But yet again, this code is unique for the Valguero map, you will not be able to use this code to spawn in, say on the island map or something, you can only use this code on the Valguero map, but yet again, to get the beta and alpha versions, all we want to do, we're going to go back into the code, we're changing the word easy to medium yet again, so your code should read admin cheat leave a space summon leave a space dragon underscore character underscore bp underscore boss underscore medium underscore c and we can activate that guy and there we have the beta dragon and we go into the code once again and we change the word medium to hard So the code should now look like that. And we're going to activate it. And spawn in the alpha version of the dragon. So like I said before, they're kind of boring. They stay in one spot. They don't really do nothing. They don't really attack. They don't really do nothing. They just look pretty good and intimidating. So if you have some kind of... Um, maybe event arena that you want to spawn a boss in that doesn't tend to wander around as much the dragon is definitely it but unfortunately it doesn't tend to attack the player that's attacking it but for the last and final boss this guy will fly around um, in circles usually <laughs> uh, and it is the manticore so let's get the codes for the manticore so here is the manticore code. It is admin cheat leave space summon leave space manticore underscore character underscore BP underscore easy underscore C. So yet again, code is unique to Valguero. Will only work on Valguero. It shouldn't work on Scorched Earth or any other maps that involve the manticore. So here you go. It is a bit more animated. And as you can see, it does tend to use its wings and fly around. So it is another boss that will fly around the well, move around the map. As you can see, it's kind of moving only one direction and not really interacting with nothing. So it is kind of useless <laughs> unless something attacks it. I believe it might it might uh, spin around in circles. That's if something attacks it, which it it's just not going to do unless I do it. But yeah, it's just going to fly in one direction. It might get stuck eventually against something like a mountain. Uh, but it breaks trees pretty easily. Yeah, it's just... Okay, it has landed, surprisingly. Okay. Right, so that was the Gamma version of the Manticore. Let's move on to the Beta and Alpha versions. So yet again, very, very easy to change. Go back into the code, and we're going to change the word easy to medium once again. It's very, very easy to change these. 
So you, your code should now look like this. Admin cheat, leave a space, summon, leave a space, manticore, underscore character, underscore BP, underscore medium, underscore C. So we spawn in. And there you have it with the blue health bar, meaning it is the beta version. And this is going to do the same thing that that one did. It's just going to start wandering off in one direction and then do its own stuff. But moving on to the alpha back into the code once more and change medium to hard so your code now reads admin cheat leave a space summon leave a space mantico underscore character underscore bp underscore hard underscore c and we spawn this bad boy in looking red with its red health bar and now it's going to do its own thing but mortals that is all of the bosses for the Valgrau one map. As you can see, they've actually spread out pretty decently. We got the medical epiphyses down here, and we have the manticores all the way down here doing their own thing. Very, very cool. So yeah, you can use these for different types of events and stuff. You can kill these uh, and get rewards. So boom, as you can see, I got the flag, I got element, and I got the trophy. So I'm just going to kill the dragons just because they're pointless and they don't tend to do nothing. The beta and the alpha. There we have it. So as you can boom, we got uh, 370 element just from killing the dragons. That's pretty cool. That is all the bosses that you can spawn on the map very easily it's up to you what you're going to do with them maybe you can come up with some really really cool ideas for having them running around on your map or on your server but i hope you enjoyed i hope you have some fun with this and i'll hopefully see you in the next video